Does that explain the importance of eating bananas? So, I can't right now. I can't do it a lot. All right. So we were, we were just we were just talking about nonprofits and she, and and this lady here she works with um she now. works with with youth she works no. with, with girls and, and I phone? had two little girls and so this is uh, you know really important for me she works with uh, an after school program for girls and so I have two little girls and, and it's really important to me and I, I want to start a, a nonprofit that that helps troubled youth because as a youth, I dealt with a lot of childhood trauma, a lot of fighting in my family because of alcoholism and poor diet. And um, I didn't realize, you know, as an adult, 30 years old, how badly my poor diet uh, affected my choices, my decisions that I made, uh, my thinking process, how, how I handled my everyday life. And, and, and Arnold would tell me, you know, yeah, eat eight bananas a day and an <laughs> avocado. And he, and he would say it very like, you know, like I was like, hey, this guy's not serious, but like, you know, I started doing what he said. I don't know what told me to do it, but I just started to do it. He made it real easy for me, too. He was just feeding me bananas after me. He wanted something to eat. I was like, yeah, yeah. He's like, what do you want? Whatever you make me. So you make me a bunch of, bunch of banana whips. But so as I was doing this, I started to notice, like, I have ADHD, I have PTSD, I deal with depression. Uh, you know, I, I, have, I had a lot of trauma growing up, and and I ate like crap. I, you know, I was told by my football coach, you know, put on weight. So I'm eating freaking McDonald's cheeseburgers, five in a hand, and just soda, all this all this uh, uh, high fructose corn syrup and these dyes and everything that they put in food. And once I cut that out of my diet now as an adult, I was eating like this until 30. I cut that out of my diet and everything in my Where life. Where were you when you were 30? Where was I when I was Before 30? Before I met you. I was, I was addicted to methamphetamine. Addicted to meth. I was, I was an alcoholic. Alcoholic. Uh, I was in uh, really unhealthy relationships. Really I made really poor choices. Depression. Uh, you know, I, I, Are you suicidal? Yeah, I've been suicidal. Yeah. Suicidal. I was running over by a truck in February. That didn't have anything to do with it, but, but uh, you know, because and of my poor, poor thought process. And that changed your life. Bananas changed my life. How long did it take? Uh, about a month. About a month. <laughs> it's been awesome. one month. What do you one think month. about that, young lady? I think it's awesome. One month. It saved changed. my life. Saved the criminals my life. in this country will change dramatically. Yeah. Juvenile yeah. delinquency will change dramatically. Yeah. Cancer will change dramatically. You believe all that? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yes, I do. Okay. Bye, right, Zach. Bye. Bye. Bye.